like everything else in Zoom Notes, PDF reading in the application is the best you'll get in a note-taking app on the iPad. That is why in this video, we're going to go through five features that make it so. Hey guys, it's Ropsy back with Paperless X. I've not been feeling well this couple of weeks and Uncle Dan has been creating content for you guys. If you've not seen those videos, we'll have a link to those in the description down below. We officially now have two voices for Paperless X. That way we can create more content for you. If you're new to our channel, hello. Make sure you subscribe and turn on your notifications so you know each time we release a new video. And if you're already subscribed, fantastic human, welcome back. Most users love the ability to see two pages of a document at a time. Zoomnos lets you do that, which you won't get in most note-taking apps. You can scroll your PDF horizontally in a continuous or paged fashion. Continuous scrolling is smoother. It would be better if page scrolling displayed two complete pages instead of locking just one page in the center and half of the other two pages on the side. This feature you don't get in any note-taking app. You don't even get it in a lot of PDF readers. You can create hyperlinks in Zoom Notes. This can be linked to text images or they can be on blank areas if you want to link them to handwriting, for example. The transition to the hyperlink can either be direct or animated. This is a very useful feature to have. Hyperlinks in Zoom Notes are even better. You can link them to other documents in the application. This takes you to all your documents where you can choose a specific page to link to. Zoom Notes is the only handwriting note-taking app we've encountered on the iPad that does this. You can then choose to highlight your hyperlinks. That way, you won't forget what you've hyperlinked in your notes. As if that's not enough, you can link your notes to other applications. Zoom Notes is able to create unique URLs for your document, which you can add to other applications. You can add this to Reminders, Apple Notes, and this will connect your notes across different applications that you're using. You can also create outlines in the application. It only supports one level, meaning you can't nest pages to create subtopics for your outline. The other kind of outline in Zoom Notes is that the application creates an outline automatically from your page titles. So it displays your pages, how they are linked together, main pages and their sub pages. So sub pages become subtopics for the main pages and this creates a hierarchy outline for you. So this is strictly not an outline, it's just how it displays your pages. And sadly, you can't export subpages out of the application. So if you create your notes this way, these notes have to stay in the application. You can use the page network in the application to visualize how everything comes together. The page network can be 2D or 3D. Say what? The page network connects all the hyperlinks and subpages in your notes. This feature makes me want to solve a mystery where you connect and link ideas and follow the links where they take you. You can customize how this mind map looks by changing the color of the background, the link color, and also the external links. You can add or remove arrows. And you can also adjust their size. And you can also change the link length. Cool, isn't it? You can choose to see the whole connected network or just the current page to focus on a specific subject, of course, or on a specific topic. The app even lets you choose how deep you want to follow the links from 1 to 20. This is basically the hierarchy levels you'll dive into following your notes. It is such a smart way to focus and zone into a specific aspect of a subject. Sometimes you need extra space to write on and usually for PDF reading, this comes as comments. However, in Zoom Notes, you probably won't miss it. 
because in the application, each page is superimposed onto an infinite canvas that you can write on. For anyone that's ever wished to have more space to write on for your PDF, Zoom notes, it's got your back. And each page in the document comes with its own canvas. Your pages are not sharing the same resources. So each page has its own infinite canvas. And you can turn on the infinite whiteboard feature so that you can expand the page infinitely if you ever needed that much space to write on. You can even change the color of the canvas. And those are the five awesome features that make PDF reading in Zoom Notes mind blowing. Let us know if we left out any features you like for PDF reading. Thank you. Fantastic human for watching. See you in the next video.